What's up, y'all, and welcome back to Sid with a T-shirt. Once again, it's your girl, Tina. In today's video, I want to show you guys my little Easter basket snack haul that I did from Myers today. But before I get into it, please do me a favor and hit that subscribe button and turn them notifications on so you'll be notified the next time I upload a video. All right, guys. Um, yeah, i just been on a snack haul, <laughs> a snack kick. I was trying to do enough to where I have at least enough like bag snacks that's not chocolate um, for at least a hundred baskets you know um, then that way I'll go get more you know I can know I know I can do at least a hundred baskets or close to it before I you know run out if my kids don't you know uh, raid my snacks but um, this is what I got um, this actually, <laughs> these were on, on sale for $1.99. This isn't part of it. This was for my daughter. She likes granola bars. Now, I do, do have, I got, they're, um, on sale at Myers. If you guys have a Myers in your area, they're two for $4, so $2 a box. Um, and they're the chocolate chip cookie dough. There's eight in a pack. Um, and these are actually the little bit bigger um, bars. They're not the real tiny ones. See? They're pretty much, you know, about that size. So I was going to put these in like the little bit bigger kids baskets. Or the teens baskets if I do teens or whatever. But pretty much just like bigger kids baskets and I got the strawberry kind which was also two for four dollars so you get 16 of them for four dollars which equals out to be uh, 25 cents you know uh, uh, a snack then I have these 52 count of the mini Rice Krispie Treats, and we got 12 chocolate, 28 original, and 12 strawberry. I really don't understand when it comes to these types of packs. Why don't they try to do it as close to even as possible? Why do they all have to be, you know, majority, you got double original? Why? Like, put an equal equal part of each flavor in there. That I don't understand why they separate it like that. Like, they just assume everybody wants original. No, put equal parts into the pack. But, anyway, I got two of these. So, um, and these are, let's see, the smaller. They're the minis. See? Okay, I'm, I'm squishing it over to the other side. So, it's about right here. The rest of this little pack is all air. So, it's a little, little right in there that's the little pack the, the little cube but we have 12 chocolate 28 original and 12 strawberry flavors in here let's see and that's what they have 52 of them you could have put at least 17 in each one <laughs> at least 17 17 to each flavor and then just pick a flavor for that extra one or two and throw it in there okay now I ended up buying two packs of diapers my nephew is going to have a baby next month and I was just trying to stock him up on diapers. I have several cases of size 2, 3s, and 4s, as well as wipes. And I had a coupon for, what, $3 off of my $10 diaper purchase. These were $8.99, so I picked up two bags and used that coupon, which equaled out to about $7.49 a bag. Uh, just something else to, to give him. I'm trying to get him as many packs. And I never do a size one or newborn diapers because there's very little difference 
from newborn to size one. And usually when you have a baby shower or come from the hospital, you get those diapers. So I want to give diapers as for when the baby is actually home, home. And you're, you're pretty much on your own. Now, I do have, um, I'm missing a box because I was trying to get to at least 100. Uh, Myers have these Kool-Aid jammers where if you buy two of them, you get a dollar off of each one. They're regular $2.85. So they're um a dollar eighty-five with that little dollar off. Plus I have this 30 pack count that was regular seven. I can't get it picked up. This regular 30 pack count that was $7.49, but we have an M Perks coupon for two dollars off of each. And um I guess I made it to the store too late because I only found one. But um, that brought it down to $5.49 for a pack of 30. And these are $1.85 for a pack of 10. Which, I mean, it's still the same where there are three of these together. Three separate packs equal the same $5.49 as buying one of these 30 packs with the $2 off. Um, and then when you divide it out, it equals to $0.18 cents a juice pouch. So... That's not bad for putting it in every, you know, one in each of your Easter baskets. Then I have the chocolate chip Pillsbury uh, mini soft baked chocolate chip cookies. There's 12 packs in here. And we have 12 packs of the Pillsbury soft baked mini funfetti cookies. See, I use, I'll be trying to get things, you know, little packs and stuff that's going to take up space in the basket. So, you know, it covers more space and maybe you have to put less items because I tend to kind of put too much items. I really feel that the Easter baskets be needing a lot of snacks. At least that's how I grew up with tons and tons of snacks and toys and stuff. And our um, Easter stuff, my mom didn't buy Easter baskets, but... She would fill the, ta fill the table up with like a huge, <laughs> we had this huge yellow bowl. And it would just be, I'm the baby. So um, it would be, she would put my toys all on the glass dining room table. Because we had, you know, everybody sit at the dining room table back in the day. At the dining room table, we had the big huge yellow bowl just stuffed full of candy. You know, it was candy that me, my brother, and my sister ate. Um, they were, they were older than me, like teenagers and stuff. And, um, like my sister's 10 years older than me and my brother is seven. So when she was 16, I was six. So it's like, I have table, my baby dolls and stuff on there. She would have, you know, her, uh, stereo system or whatever. My mom was set on a, um, the big dining room glass table with our snacks and stuff in the middle. And... That's just how I feel that the Easter baskets need to have a lot of, you know, toys and snacks. Even though it shouldn't put all the chocolate in there because they may melt being out there trying to sell them. Anyway, I'm rambling. Um, with these cookies, it ended up being, they were on sale, well, yeah, on sale for $4.49. And when you divide that out by the 12, that equals $0.37 cents, um, a pack of cookies. So that's not bad, paying $0.37 cents for a little pack of cookies to put in the basket. Uh, these right here were, let's see, let's see. I think they was for something as well. And I didn't write them down. Nope. Or they was five, yeah, they was like five forty nine. dollars I think they were on sale um, for five forty nine. dollars So when you divide these out by 12, that's 45 cents, um, you know, a pack. And yeah, I opened these in the store because I really wanted to see. I got them because I wanted the little cheese balls. I was thinking about some type of a chip for the, you know, the little ones. Um, last year, I had went with the bigger cases of chips that had like 30 chips in it. It can't because I was looking for those fluffy cheese puffs. And the 30 count pack of chips at Sam's Club had those. But this year, I mean, the, the case of chips is like $18.48. So I wasn't going to buy another case just to get, you know, um, eight packs of those chips because it's like a multi-pack. 
and uh, so I was looking for something different to put in place and these little the little cheese ball I'm trying to screw it up this is one little cheese ball so they're pretty pretty tiny little cheese balls in there which I think you can actually give it to the baby because um, their spit will you know dissolve it it is teeny tiny already so I got two packs it comes with four in there so I only have eight packs but it's got the little cheese ball, some uh, iced uh, animal crackers, and we got the little fudge stripes. So this would just add on to, you know, my other little cookies or whatever. But I got it pretty much for the little cheese balls. I wish I could find just the cheese balls. Let's see. And this is a pack of the little animal cookies. So that'll take up a nice, you know, a little space inside of a basket. Let's see. And here's the little fudge ones. So they kind of look like the little bags of chips that you get, uh, the cookies that you get from Dollar Tree, where you get like four or six of these little packs in a, in a pack. They're about that size. And then, last but not least, I have these. Now, I got another pack of these. Um, the 45 count, but those ones from Sam's Club came with the regular cheddar and the color ones. Um, so I grabbed these just to get different flavors. And this is a 30 pack from Myers, and it came with we got zesty cheddar mix. Um, yeah, it's got cheddar and zesty cheddar and parmesan mixed together. We got nine of those. Then you got the Flavor Blasted Extra Cheddar, 11 of those. And we got the Flavor Blasted Extra Cheesy Pizza, 10 of those. Just to give a variety um, of the goldfish in the baskets. And these were $11.99, which divided out by 30 is $0.39 cents a pack. So this was pretty much the highest item from, you know, this haul that I got to go in my baskets and actually I think this is the highest item so far point because um, I did a Sam's Club haul as well and I don't think any of those items broke down to 39 cents um, a piece alrighty guys this is it for my Myers Easter basket snack haul please do me a favor and hit that subscribe button and turn them notifications on so you'll be notified the next time I upload a video. And with that being said, see you next time.